right, thanks for joining me. This is a quick tutorial on how to share a Google Doc. There's going to be a lot of times in using Google Drive that you'll want to share a document that you've created with a colleague that you work with, um, such as another teacher and the same department, and they want to use that same document in their class. So uh, this is a quick rundown on some of those rules regarding sharing documents. If you are in the middle of your Drive account and you find a file you want to share, just click on it, as I've done here. It's highlighted in blue. And at the top of the screen, there's a little uh, person with a plus sign next to their head. That's the Share button. If you click on the Share button, a window pops up, and you have a couple of options here. First one is to get a shareable link. If you click on Get Shareable Link, it automatically copies it to your clipboard, or you can highlight and copy it here and there are some rules regarding that link that show up. First of all, right now it's set to anyone with the link can view. I can click on this drop down menu and change that so that if I want others to edit that document, they can. And I'm going to go ahead and click off of that. Um, and then all I have to do is click copy link or as I've already said, once you click get shareable link, it copies it to your clipboard. Another option is to share this document by using a colleague's email address. Now the difference between this and just link sharing is that if I copy the link and then I paste that in an email, they only have the link for the document as long as they have the email. But if I put their name in this box down here and if I put their, for instance, their email address, then that becomes a file that's part of their Google Drive and it goes into their incoming folder. So I can also change the the rules on that from can edit to can comment or can view if I want to. And then I can even add a note and they'll receive an email that says I've shared this document with you and it provides a link where they can go see it in their Google Drive. There's also an advanced feature button down here at the bottom. If you click advanced uh, then you see all sorts of options. You see where you can share your document via email, Google+, Facebook, or Twitter. Uh, you can also change the overall sharing settings for the document. And then at the bottom you still have the option of inviting people by email. And when you're finished you just click done. Uh, the other thing that you're going to notice is that once you share a document with someone uh, there's a little icon that pops up to the right of the document and it shows two people. That means that this item has been shared with someone and you can click on the share button at any time to see a list of who it has been shared with. Anytime as someone has shares a document with you on the other side of it, it shows up in your incoming box and these are documents that have been shared with me. And then finally the last thing I'm going to point out is that when you uh, are inside a document, you also have the option of going to the top right of the page on Docs and Presentations and uh, Sheets. You can go to the top right, click on Share, and then you can see the exact same options that we just showed from inside Drive. Well, hopefully that gives you a quick rundown on sharing a doc. Uh, later on we'll share some other things such as sharing a folder and how to upload a doc to Google Drive.